The Black Eyed Peas. Congratulations on the release of this new album. I have Gracias. to say as a Latina, I'm really, really excited about this one. I mean, it feels like forever since the last time that you guys released an album, but I know it's been just a few years. But I mean, we're always wanting more from you. Siempre queremos un poquito más de ustedes y me parece que fue hace mucho tiempo la última vez que lanzaron un álbum. ¿Qué significa este álbum para ustedes? What does this album mean to you guys? Uh, to us, it means uh, cultural collaboration, uh, inspiration, uh, the people that uh, uh, you know we're a fan of and that we're inspired by. We wanted to uh, be the translator of like combining two worlds together and making it for the world. Y para mí, como el latino de Black Eyed Peas, es como un sueño real. Es algo que para mí, creciendo en este Los Ángeles como mexicano, um, apreciando toda la música latina, salsa, cumbia, merengue, y ahora nos podemos enfocar en este álbum Translation, um, con artistas como J Balvin, como Maluma, uh, Shakira, Osuna y todos estos artista, artistas que nos inspiran. Where does the idea come from? ¿De dónde viene la idea de hacer un álbum completamente Spanglish? We're, we're product of, of Los Angeles, you know? Um, and in LA, you have Africano, Mexicano, um, Filipino, Gringos. Um, <laughs> todo gente aquí. I like how you said todo, that. <laughs> gente en el mundo aquí, en Los Angeles. We've worked with, with uh, Latino artists in the past, you know, before we actually focus on translation. Uh, Joan Sebastián, Will I Am, trabajó con él. Um, so la Latino music and, and the culture has always been part of our upbringing, as, as I mentioned earlier. And we just focused on it and celebrate it. And that's what you get with this translation album. Eh, yo como latina, de verdad que disfruto muchísimo que este álbum sea totalmente en, en Spanglish. Pero les tengo que preguntar, ¿qué hace al fanático hispano tan especial? What makes Hispanic fans so special? You know, all the different varieties of, of, of Latin. Cubans are different than Colombians, and Colombians are different than Dominicans, and Dominicans are different than Puerto Ricans, and Puerto Ricans are different than Venezuelans. Panama, you have so many different flavors. And one thing about Latin culture is everyone's proud of being Latin. In 2011, we tocamos un, un estadio in en, en Estados Unidos, and that was Miami. It's a big shout out to Miami. Pero por todo el mundo, in Sur America, in Mexico, podemos hacer estadios, Estadio Azteca, todos los, los, los estadios de fútbol, um, los, los Latinos lo apreciaron. No, no nos dijeron, oh, you gotta change your language, tiene que cambiar el idioma. They're like, no, I got a feeling is I got a feeling. Me siento el, el ambiente de I got a feeling. So that's the beautiful thing is like, we didn't have to change our language for Latinos to embrace it. Everyone has their own style of like rhythms and, and dancing and, 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 and like dance moves, you know? It's, it's all <laughs> different and then it's all sexy. That the language is like, you know what I mean? It's like, you know what I mean? It's good for like, <laughs> for like, you know the language. Saying? When you, when you game, when you game it, you're like, yeah, but you know what I'm saying? Like, uh, amor, you know, that's like, a, you know, very sexy. Hey, good, good rolling those R's. Um, y estás mencionando a J Balvin que tienen esta canción con el ritmo es mi canción favorita en este momento Gracias. y hay una parte de la canción en la que dice como Canelo en el ring nada me asusta like that's so awesome for sports fans I was like oh my gosh I love this song me encanta esta canción and I, I want to ask you guys uh, how special are sports for you because I mean you're also in my top three uh, favorite Super Bowl halftime shows. Ustedes están en mi top tres de Super Bowl halftime shows eh, favoritos. ¿Qué tan especial son los deportes para ustedes? We, we have a lot of songs that they play in, um, in, in sporting matches, whether it's basketball, baseball, football, you know, boxing, UFC. Um, we, have, we have a lot of sports anthems. To do the Super Bowl, that's like, that's a dream come, uh, come true. And coming up, you know, coming from the scoreboard, 
to perform. It was a bit scary as well. Inviten a toda la gente que por favor busquen este álbum que es la verdad que va a ser un himno para todos los latinos y es un himno a la diversidad. Amigos um, latinos all over the world, mi gente, please check out a nuevo álbum que se llama Translation con artistas, los favoritos artistas latinos we're representing, we're proud and we're thankful for you guys embracing this record. We can't wait for the world to see what we got next. Thank you. Thank you, guys. Thank you. Gracias, Ana. Gracias, Ana. <laughs> Bye. Oh, oh, Éxitos. Oh, Ana. Oh, 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 oh,